Abdullahi Diop, Malian Minister of Foreign Affairs, said this message is situated, first of all, in the context of Mali, notably the challenges and progress linked to the transition process for which we should bring the conclusions to the attention of the President of the Islamic Republic of Mauritania. Mali has been soliciting support from regional countries to help in its transition despite the ongoing sanctions by the ECOWAS. We will continue to work hand-in-hand in in dialogue to ensure that the transition process in Mali can be completed in a consensual framework and in a framework of dialogue. We also hope that the regional and African communities as well as the international community will take the necessary steps to better understand and appreciate the situation in our country. Leaders from the economic community of West Africa states ECOWAS agreed to sanction Mali last week, imposing a trade embargo and shutting borders in a decision later backed by the United States, the European Union and former colonial power France.